Hi, this is Steph with Bella Donna Dyes, and today we're going to make a pleat fold primary color rainbow shirt. I've turned the shirt inside out and I'm going to fold it in half. I'm using the yardstick to help me get a nice crisp line. Since the shirt has been folded in half, you want to try to keep that center line as straight as possible while you're creating your pleats. Secure with rubber bands or kite string, whichever you prefer. Continue to pleat the whole length of the sleeve. I decided to use kite string to secure the pleats in the sleeve. Work your way all the way down to the cuff and then work your way back and secure it with a simple double knot. Continue securing the rest of the shirt. In my case, that's by using rubber bands.
Remember, our shirt has been folded in half. So you'll want to start by creating your first line and keeping it rather narrow. As you begin to add the other colors, you can increase their width. Overlapping the edges of our primary colors is what gives us our secondary colors. This particular shirt actually batched for 48 hours. That's a matter of preference. I feel like I want the most vibrant colors that I can possibly achieve. Start by rinsing your shirt with cold water to stop any soda ash that may be left in the shirt, and then increase the water up to very, very warm. Rinse until the water begins to run clear.
From here, the shirt is gonna go into the washing machine on a hot water cycle using Synthropol detergent, which is a textile soap. And then I'm going to wash it in another hot water cycle using Millsoft to bring softness back into the shirt. And then I'll put it in the dryer and we'll see our final results. So here are the final results of our shirt and I think it turned out super funky. I think any little guy running around town will look super cool wearing this shirt. I do like how we have a little bit of purple where the turquoise and the fuchsia red mixed together. And you notice how we got some bright green where the yellow and the turquoise mixed together. I'm not seeing very much orange, but the fuchsia is very overpowering. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and click the bell for future notifications. Have fun tie-dyeing!